We invented local news. City Pulse News Team brings you Toronto News. Now, we're doing it again. Coming this fall, we're launching an all-news channel that will change the way you get your news. Here's what's making news right now. The young pilot of a small plane runs out of fuel and makes a white-knuckle landing behind a Burlington school. Lockdown at a school on the East Mall. The scare for students and parents after gunfire near Burnham Thorpe Collegiate. And this spring weather is nothing to sneeze at. Two of the city's biggest news stations coming together. City News and 680 News. This is 680 News. To cover the GTA like only we can. Here at the GM Oshawa plant, a second and third shift have been added. From Oshawa to Oakville, from Barrie to the beaches. Dogs will be able to roam freely at Kew, Balmy and Woodbine beaches. A newscast for where you live and the way you live. It's the information you want when you want it. 24 hours a day, seven days a week in a format that fits your schedule. You will need the umbrella for tomorrow morning. We've got clear skies, mild temperatures and light winds. Our weather forecast already the most accurate in the GTA. We'll be linked with traffic and delivered to you on the ones of every hour. We're live to Eva at 680 News. Nice found on the 401. It's moving quite slowly as you make your way from east of the 410. Today actually turned out to be a fairly decent day. Sports fans will get their updates at 15 and 45 past the hour. The Leafs lead the entire NHL with six points in three games. For the first time, the Raptors begin a season without a bona fide star, and investors will be kept in the loop with regular business reports at 26 and 56 minutes past the hour. Plus, breaking news as it happens. Breaking news from the White House. President Barack Obama is expected to announce at any moment that Osama bin Laden is dead. Headlines from Toronto to Ottawa and from around the world. Cleanup begins after a double earthquake in Spain. As many as 15,000 took to the streets of Athens, pelting riot police who fought back with tear gas. And the local stories that matter to you. This is where it ended, right here on Keel Street, just south of Annette, more than an hour after it began, after ETF officers hit the suspect with several gunshots. Featuring all your favorite City News personalities. You've been a manager, you've been an NHL coach, you've been a waitress at Hooters. <laughs> no, wait a minute, that's <laughs> not right. Safia Kambalia has the answer. She's looking ahead to tell you. Okay, sorry. Gordon, here's my son. <laughs> you know, people think uh, sock lines are bad. Wait till you get the sweet ski boot line going. Give us a good one. I'm a little scared right now. Actually, I'm a, I'm a lot scared. This is City News. On University Avenue, I'm Avery Haynes, City News. In North York, Melanie Ng, City News. At the Sony store at Young and Front, Safia Kambalia, City News. In Mississauga, Francis D'Souza, City News. Audra Brown, City News. At Chesswood Arena, Peter Kim, City News. At Duke Cycle, Cynthia Mulligan, City News. Andrea Puno, City News. We didn't show all the highlights. Take a look at There's just a few oh, more here. Oh, no, you didn't. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, I can't even describe that. <laughs> Just... <laughs> oh my goodness, I just so made my night. Plus, experts from Hello Canada, Flair, McLean's Magazine, Chatelet, Today's Parent, and Canadian Business. This proven format, while keeping viewers informed, also represents endless sales and marketing opportunities. City News Biz Facts brought to you by RBC Direct Investing. Gain online investing experience with a practice account. Brought to you in part by At My Best, developed in partnership with AstraZeneca Canada and Physical Education and Health Canada. Brought to you in part by Nabob, better beans, better coffee, better planet. Join us for an exciting and unique way to connect with Toronto's news, City News.